Tip cups to the ceiling if you're sick of feeling ripped off. I let my fist start, get lit and lift off. Raise your hands if you're with me and you're pissed off. I'm standing on the corner of 6th Street. I'm running out of time for this week. My head's pounding, stomach shaking. It's worth it, the hunger makes it. Hey everybody, it's me, it's BPTV, and we are back with uh, a little more adventures in April. Uh, and as, as of today, uh, what is today? Today, as we're watching this, will be April 30th. Uh, and it was today that we got Pokemon Emerald uh, was released. So I'm going to do a special Nuzlocke challenge uh, <laughs> beginning of uh, Pokemon Emerald. Uh, we're not going to do a, a full one, as we're going to also do two other games tonight, uh, Pokemon related. Um, but we're going to start with Pokemon Emerald. So. There we go. Uh, so yeah, as I was saying, uh, this was back in the days where instead of DLC, they did a, a third game of the franchise that offered different Pokemon that you could catch, uh, and add on story elements and things like that. Uh, so yeah, uh, I've actually never really played Emerald. Uh, Ruby, uh, I played Ruby, um, and then Omega Ruby, and I believe I also played Omega Sapphire, uh, but I never actually played Emerald, which was the extra one. So, uh, this should be interesting. Should be fun. Let's see what happens here. That was apparently a B that I hit there. Right. Remap your brain, Nate. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, I didn't put the text speed on fast. Shit. It's okay. These things happen. Hi! Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. It's a low tech bastard. This world is inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friendly playmates and the nine we work mates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many Pokemon secrets surrounding the Unreal Mysteries. I'm taking research, and that's what I do. And you are. Who am I? Move that closer a little bit. Like, yes! Uh, actually, it's almost like my gain's gone back down. What the fuck? I don't understand you. Why, microphone? Why? Why do you act differently every time I turn the thing on? I don't know. Anyways, that's back to normal. Good. Uh, alright. Oh, what's... Wow. Burns. I just accidentally reset it. <laughs> oh, I did the same thing myself. Shit, spot. Well, it's fine. These things happen. Alright. Basically, we're going to build our initial team, and that's about how far we're going to go. Uh, I'm going to wait until we get to a point where I'm not going to be editing this out. Alright. Uh, basically, we're just going to build the team to the point where we either... Uh, where we've got our, our initial squad, and we're going to stop there. But, yeah. What's your name? Like I said, the last time I would have played what I did Omega Ruby and Omega Sapphire, and that would have been about a year ago. Eh, more than that, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I'm on this, man. Help! Look at you getting chased around by that little old fucking uh, Zigzagoon. All right, this is it. Uh, first leg of the race, we've got to do a... Um, little dice roll here. Dice roll. To decide whether or not we are going to take a... Uh, yeah, it's excited. Perfect. Roll our way. All right, we're going to take the Pokemon on the far left. That's what's happening here. 
We rolled a one for the record. So that means we start with a Trico. I've used all these Pokemon for the record, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, Trico was the first starter that I chose, though, for the game. Um, Septile's my boy. I love me, my Trico. Uh, so cool that I get to use through again. Again, I used all three starters at one point or another because I played the game through three times. I did Ruby on the Game Boy Advance initially, uh, and then I did uh, Omega Ruby and Omega Sapphire, so I've used all three between uh, those three games. I liked all of them. This is one of the games where I liked all the starters evenly. Um, Trico again obviously being my favorite. Yeah, in terms of uh, Gen 1, uh, Charmander, my top one, my favorite. Uh, we're using my second pick, which is Squirrel right now. Uh, and Bulbasaur, third one. Again, it's another generation where I liked everything. Um, Gen 2, uh, Totodile and Cyndaquil were the only two I really liked. Um, Gen 3, which is where we are in this one, obviously, I just described, but yeah. I'm not going to go past that, because I don't know, can't be arsed with that. Oh, look at that. Quick, that, that's better round. Yeah, we did. Whew. Uh, oh, yeah. What am I going to name Trico? Uh, naming him after my own Leopard Gecko, which means if I lose him, it will hurt so bad. All right. First Pokemon down. Got to build the squad yet. Can't remember if Mom gives me my shoes right now or not. Like, red and blue, I never caught the initial Pokemon that they offered you because I just knew I didn't want them. I watched the anime, and I didn't. I just knew they weren't the ones for me. I knew there were bigger and better things later on, whereas this game, I don't know, everything I saw, I was like, Ooh, you look cool. Ooh, you look cool. Ooh, you look cool. Goes to show how they got better at designs, I guess, as they went on. Oh, snap. I should have uh, healed up a little before this, apparently. Oh, well. I'm a level higher. Might come to my advantage. I got a potion in my bag, too. Might use that. I don't usually do that, but... I ain't losing to my rival on the first run, that's for sure. Oh, they're both just going all out, no status changes, just hammering at one another. Woo! Go Mondo. Alright, uh, time to head back. Okay. Oh, hi, Beefy TV. May has been helping. Extensive history here, Beefy TV. <laughs> I ordered you a Pokedex. Thank you. High tech Pokemon Encyclopedia, blah, blah, blah. I used it to collect data on Pokemon, field research, etc., etc. And the Pokeballs. Alright, this is where things get interesting. Hey, you. Alright, let's check it. Uh-huh, 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 Running shoes! That's the shit right there. Do it. Ooh, Puchaina. Right out of the gate. Not what I expected, but cool. I'm down. I did train. Uh, I uh, might have wound up on one of my end teams, so I'm okay with this.
Bam! Good to go. Giggles! <laughs> Let's go heal. <laughs> All right. So, uh, like I say, I'm okay with this. Maitayina was one of my uh, end uh, Pokemon my first run or my second run. Can't remember. So, I'm cool with that. All right. So, we'll come up here. So, Route 103. Let's see what we catch here. A Wingle. All right. Fuck. This is uh, another... Pokemon that I've already trained once, but that's okay. Like I said, uh, I took a Pelipper all the way to the end. Uh, Water Flying type was an awesome combination. Alright, we got ourselves a Wingle. John Livingston Seagull. Hello. Well, I could have waited and gotten a water type, but I got a water type anyway, so fuck you, game. I win. <laughs> right? That's how that works. Because it's trying to harm me that way. So cool. Alright. Uh, that's not a bad start. This is a lot like one of the teams I've uh, mixed in matches of some of the teams I've played as before. Hmm. I've never trained a Lotad. I don't really have a need for it right now. I have a water type. I have a plant type. But you know what? A water plant type. I'm down with it. I've got room to do it. So I'm going to do it. Actually, this is even smarter. All right, man. Well, let's go back and heal. <laughs> it's not a bad uh, four Pokemon starter, really. Like, that's a pretty good starter set. End of the day. Hi, Dad. Uh -huh. Yep, we are. Hi, Wally. We'll just get this over with now. Rude and Turf, blah, 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 blah. Now yeah, well, let's go back to the gym. Let's get this shit over with. Oh, oh excuse me. Rustboro, Roxanne, gym badges, 10 4. Well, that's new. Uh, I don't remember that from Ruby. Anywhere. Shit on a stick. You're a toughen. Whew. Thanks for the drama, buddy. God damn. Sorry, part of a Nuzlocke is naming your Pokemon. Uh, it makes you that much more attached. Believe me, it works. You you wouldn't think it would, but it does. Something that you take the time to name uh, makes you that much more attached, even as if it is a digital creature. Be sure to check out the Is That All podcast for all of your geek news. You can find us anywhere you can stream and download podcasts, and find us on social media at Is That All Pod. Don't forget to like and s <laughs> Fuck me. So many hours without sleep. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps me grow and lets me know that you guys like the content that I'm putting out there. Don't forget to check out more videos, especially more console capers. And you can find me everywhere on social media at BeefyThiefy.